Hello, so by the end of this video, you should be able to close a pop-up context menu or any other model by clicking outside. This is very important in UX design as a user expects to click outside and leave the context. So in this case, I have my button over here and when we click it, we have our context menu. So when we click outside, we are able to dismiss it. So let's do this. So right now I'm in VS Code and when we check, I've already created few files. That's my index.html to stretch out uh, the content, the style.css and the script.js. So in my index.html file, what I've simply done is I have a button, that's the open button and has an on-click uh, event, that's the toggle menu with a class of btn. Then I have an ordered list with a class of menu and id of menu. Then I have three list items with a class of menu item, that's the edit, delete and close. And then I have uh, the link to the style file and then the script.js file. And in my style.css, I already have the styles defined out. Uh, that's the color of the button, the hover effect, the menu. And then the important class I would like to show you is the show here. So the menu by default is with display none. And then when we give it a class of show, it has a display of block. So this is the very important class that we shall be using. So what I want is when someone clicks a button, I give it uh, I toggle a class of show and when someone uh, like clicks outside I remove this class and then the display is none so the menu is not displayed. So let's move to the script.js file. I have an empty script.js file. So right now if we check our code so we have all this designed out so the design is already implemented but when we click we don't see that uh, menu over here. So I would like to toggle it every time someone clicks the button. So I'd move here. First call out my menu that's with document dot get element by id and i gave it an id of menu so i want to define my function here that's the toggle the toggle menu which is called every time uh, someone clicks our button so when we call this function we want to toggle our class on the menu so by toggling i mean uh, add it and then remove it if it's on remove it uh, and if it's not part of the class lists we add it so that's what i'll do is a uh, menu dot class list dot toggle that's the class show that I showed you in the standard CSS file we don't need this right now it's toggling the class uh, show so we can see the model and then hide it but when we click outside uh, we cannot close it so that's what we work we want to work on so to close it we want to listen to uh, the windows events if someone clicks the window, we want to know that what they have clicked is actually outside our model or outside our context menu in this case. So if it is outside, then we close. That will move the show class. But if it is inside, then we don't remove the show class. So let's do this. So first we listen to our window. That's window.onClick. Window.onClick. Let me use the hello function over here. Takes in an event. Let's put a condition here. That's if uh, I get it the event the target so matches and that's our class on the button. That's the button class BTN. So we're asking uh, if the event uh, does not match uh, the BTN. Then again, we want to check if the event uh, does not match our menu. So here we are checking if the event uh, does not match our button. Then next, we want to check uh, if our menu contains the show. Uh, the class list contains the show. If yes, then we remove it. So we are checking if menu if menu dot class list uh, dot contains and that's show. If it does contain it, then we want to remove it. That's with the menu dot class list dot remove still show. Sorry about that. Show. Okay, let's check what we have so far. So if I load up our page over here and when we click we are able to open and close but what if we click outside so we are able to close the model but one thing that's left is that uh, when I click inside the model or the context menu it still disappears and this is because of uh, propagation so what you want to do is want to uh, stop propagation every time I click inside so to do that I would move out here at the end and then say menu dot add uh, event listener and I want to listen out for a click so that's an event and then uh, event dot stop propagation it's right over here and that's it so when we run this 
everything works fine so when i click inside it does not close but when i click outside it closes so that's it that's how to uh, click outside to close the model context menu so in case you need the source code i've left a link to the article that i wrote sometime with the code and you can be able to get it i thank you for watching see you next time